as I listen to the preacher say in chapter 420 same number of words you can type on Facebook as he says we must repent we must we must we must repent therefore giving us the guilty feeling inside of us we must repent to Jesus the power the energy everything is Jesus so follow the man of Jesus but you must follow the Bible and see inside the Bible the deceit as well as the corrections it makes upon the difference Matthew Jacob Genesis whichever one it is each one will correct the other saying of another gospel they're in there to show you two sides of the story God doesn't come in with one side of the story he needs us to understand what love is because love is what brings us all the way up higher and higher because it's love when you understand love you understand the reason for doing what you do and what you do you do it for the reason and it's the understanding because that's your desire and your desire for that is the love of what it is now the question is are we loving things we shouldn't love being in places we shouldn't be repent repent feel sorry for yourself be weak be very weak repent there is no repentance a repentance is a sentence it is a word to repeat what you have done and to go over and kill your mind just to kill your mind so you can no longer control yourself and you think it's all Jesus I've got to follow Jesus like I said in my past videos I changed that in chapter 40 there is no Jesus there is a Yeshua and a Christ a power and energy of love yes Shua it means yes to shoo away the little angels shoo shoo little fly Yeshua shoo shoo I come here in honesty upon the knowledge of what I have of the father and everybody says well it's his father it's his father no he was referring to the father of man the creator because words weren't understood back then and then they were turned around as Judas Icarius went up and kept telling him about what was going on with Jesus is only because he was worried about the rest of the society he was on his toes in the Last Supper he wore green he wore almost what Jesus wore the only one and the only one standing and standing on the side of the mother of Mary Mangalin who represents the mother of Jesus so he's sitting on one end of the table now on the other end of the table is six people two groups three and three command and create Jesus Christ it was an expression but they were sitting at the corner the first group was sitting at one o'clock the second group was sitting at two o'clock there was no third group there was nobody opposite or opposing Judas at all no one was opposing the ones on the corner were saying I'm, I'm on the corner of both sides and having Judas Icarius right across from where the two o'clock was okay these people are saying something different they're saying I have a vision on you but I'm on the corner of the table so I'm in between you and Jesus what's going on here how are we gonna advance this into the future Jesus will get knocked out and Judas knew that and Judas knew also that he had to have the power inside of him to continue so what did he do next because all we hear is how bad Judas was and I talked about Judas about how bad he was every single time I came out with my book and now I'm starting to say he was the opposition he was actually bringing out the righteous of all of them the righteous to see the difference is Judas taking the other side he didn't send them in to get killed he was sentencing Jesus to go up and speak with them. Jesus himself decided to let them kill him. He could have ran. He could have stopped talking. He didn't do any of those things. He let them kill him saying, I'm standing up for what I believe. I'm going up on the cross. You guys can do what you want. This is what I believe. Now, either you follow me into the future or you follow a guy like Judas who tells you all the lies. And the reason he says that, he calls him all the lies, because Liza Minnelli, lies of many men many men means Christ the lie of one man now what it means okay is many things whether it means to lie down to put something up and believe so deeply in himself that he was willing to put himself on the cross even for a story that might not be true in which today everybody wrote about it you see it was an opening to the new era when Christ was out Christ brought upon man to open up all the churches to go out to open up their own restaurant to go out to open up their own business God sent Jesus here to open up the eyes of everybody. He didn't really care exactly 
uh, which way he went with his talking. All he knew is he had to save men, and that's what he was here for. So when you start reading these books and the disciples, if you don't know who the disciple is and how they think, whatever you read out of that book is only going to be based on what you think. You're going to see what he's trying to transvey, and you're going to take it in the way you see it. And the way you see it is only one. You see, I'm going to try and develop a system uh, online that costs absolutely nothing, maybe a, a little bit for me, to where we can all come in and discuss certain, certain things, but in a certain manner because we're too many people. So there has to be a certain manner to be able to go around with these too many people, and that's by picking so many subjects uh, either per day or per week or per session, whatever it is, so we can rehash everything and bring everything back to a fashion where everything means nothing. Because I just read somewhere uh, on one of the Bibles, it was talking about, it came into the time of nil. Well, nil means zero. It means to the left of me and to the right. Five to the left, five to the right. Five to the left, five to the right, one to the center. Five, one, five of who I am. I am 11. And sticking my hands like this, Yahoo, we represent and clap for who we are. Um, what else did I get done here? Um, yes, I'm, I'm uh, taking apart the alphabet and to begin the alphabet I begin with the letter Y A Y B Y C Y D Y E Y F Y G and I stop because the piano stops right there. Then I'll put in the black keys after. Now why do I put Y? Because they're each individual expression letters okay under the basics of what they call digits which means the fingers okay and we don't count the thumb because every time you count the thumb the thumb helps you to hold on to things the thumb would be number one or number five it's the passage the thumb it's a number five passage it's a number 14 equals five passage it's a number 23 equals five passage it's a number 32 equaling a five passage now the difference with what I just told you now we have to reflect um, four and one we get it on dice three and two we get it on dice two and three we get on dice right that's it there's no other ways to get it unless you have only one dice and you have a five and there's only one person that's an egghead in this world and it's God because he's O everything and O okay O E A U O is the birth letter O means water and he's everything he's O five because O is the start of the digits which is zero to nine which is O O O one to nine O Y so it would look something like this if I can get the light to it you see the way it says 1000 here O O O one because these are our years okay Ah, now we get it. This is it. This is the years now. Here is the one spirit, and then in this would be the beta creation, and this is man's creation, and this is life, and it ends on the fifth one over here, uh, which induces one, two, three, four, five, which induces to tell us about the Mayan calendar and how everything works. I put the Y because the one or the A okay is a letter it's individualized and it's an expression it's not connected to BCD or anything else not yet we explain each letter each number individualized so we separate by going in every letter up until G we put a Y but we have to do that for the whole alphabet because the whole alphabet has a way of expression we have to put Y's so when they say to you 50 ways to lead your lover in that song it seriously is 50 ways to lead your lover because we put the Y between all the letters of the alphabet, okay? And when you do that, the whole alphabet, you get one side and the other side, the 25th letter. Between Z, A, and B, the 25th letter, the Ys equal 50. The Y here connects to the B here equals 50, okay? All of these have a different value, accumulation and association. The same with the zeros. And it's the zeros, okay, if you spell zero, it equals 64. Now let me see this, 26, 31, 41, 49, 59, 64. And 64 is the angel of man connect Israel, is what they say. 
and they're all digits, single digits. And all single digits, if I tell you, uh, my friend, go up and look in the dictionary, the word great, uh, that's a single word. That's one digit. It's one word. You're looking up great. So we singularize all the beginning. And then the zeros we start to use up. As we, as we, as we go higher in, in expression, the zeros go up. And then all of a sudden you get to a time of expression where we have this number here. The Mayan count, 25,625. It's all an expression that works all along in time, all the time. I'm going to light up a cigarette, okay? I'm going to get a drink of water. But I'm not sure if I'm allowed to show these, but... This is, the, these are my visions that I get. So I just design, I just let my hand go free and just put together a few things and one of them that you might like is this one here. Okay, you see the mug and dovin in the center? Delta V. Four times five is 20. Another one here, another one here. Four times four is 16, times four is 64. This is the Lexus sign if I turn it the other way. You can turn it into the Lexus sign. But there's three triangles in there. And then there's one at the top. But the one at the top, if you notice, you see the red line going through it? Because it extends to open up into life. And everything in life has to do with this. The J letter, J-E. It curls inside, creates a J-E. And at the bottom, the J creates a U for Urantia. There's always an element of expression, explanation inside whatever gets done. This is basically, I just, I just keep throwing things together. And let's see if I got anything. Let me try and get my keyboard off my lap for a second. And see if I have anything in here. Oh, I always like this one. I, this is sideways, but I always like this one. You know, you can make out whatever you want from it. But I did about 100 of these. I just keep putting them together. You know, sometimes when you let your mind loose, you get into a night part and you buzz out a little bit, lifting your mind. You just start going, not fast, but very slow. A line and a line and a line and a line. And for five hours, I will work on these pictures and let the lines come together. As in this world, all lies will come together at the end. All lines will either expand and keep going north and south, east and west forever and ever, or they'll be going crossways and always bumping into things. And you know what? In our next life, the more things you bump into, the luckier you are. Because in this life, it seems like we're not taking advantage of bumping into anything at all without saying, fuck you. And fuck means blue. It means the Navy SEALs. You see, the Navy SEALs, I'm not sure where I wrote this in my book. Um, no, you see, I keep losing stuff. But uh, the Navy SEALs, um, there's just something really weird going on in this world and it all extends between Kansas City and Ohio that Mississippi River something to do with the Titanic boat that went out that was pirate shipped and they moved them over and um, Something about these boats Newfoundland New England Maine uh, all these, this on the far side of Canada. It's used for something. There's a passage there things are going on I mean, I, I'm talking to you this way. They do the same thing in the Bible. They repeat something you already read. He's just explaining it in his own words. Although I'm not explaining much here except for telling you there's something definitely going on in this world. And I can repeat it and talk about it over and over again. I'm not out to destroy anything. I only think if I did destroy something, it would be probably a system. And systems, you can write them up and put them on blueprints anytime. So you're not hurting anything but the paper the system once was on. But the system is not seeming to help anybody at all. For some reason, everybody is mad. But I can't be mad because I don't watch the news and I don't watch TV anymore. And I don't listen to the radio unless they're singing a song. I don't want to hear what anybody has to say unless it's really in music. Because in music, it comes from the true divine of the heart. They're not telling you a story. They're telling you the story in music. And it's the, the stroke of the strings and the press of the keys that eliminate inside my eyes to see deeper inside the song of the words they sing. And even when the music goes and I hear the tut-tut and I hear the slur sound. So when I hear a slur sound, okay, I try to say, okay, what has a slur? 
They say steer has a slur sound. Slur, sister, it's just a slur. You can find a word because of the tap of the music. The dot, 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 the bing, bang, ding, a ling, a ding, ding. Bing, bang, ding, a ling, a ding, ding, all have letters. So once they have letters, you can now uh, focus and stretch it out into numbers or extend or shorten the word with just adding the letter Y, in which is an exchange student, and the letter T, which is an exchange student, and the letter S. And all these letters, okay, all exchange uh, normally with the jack. So now i got to write that out, that um, Y equals exchange. Uh, S, T, and the answer is Jack. Because we're all Jacks. Everything, every time you have a Y uh, over, over 10, like the minute you have a letter that's 12th letter, right, you say 10 and 2. If you have the 23rd letter, you say, or you say like this, if you have the 23rd letter, let me write this down so I can think at the same time. 23rd letter equals W, which equals uh, J, but instead of using C, you would use the uh, 3 and 3 is 6, you would use the F. So this is what happened when you get into the second scenario, let's say um, with the letter 23, okay, 20 is the letter T, so right away you have to go back to Jack. Now W, okay, is in the second scenario, it says 23, so what you would do is double up the 3 because it's not in the tens. It's in the 20 section, which means two times. So you double up the three, which would be the letter C. So it would either be JCC or JF, JL, JR, okay? Now, J because what happens is the F is the sixth letter, the L is the 12th letter, the R is the 18th letter, okay? So you'd have JF, J JL, JR, or you would, uh, would have F, R, L, okay? But now, the L is now exchangeable for the queen because the queen is the 12th card. So you'd have F comma bracket L Q. So now you have the FLQ in Quebec. Now what was that all about? Go back to 1972-73. There was something going on here in Quebec, the FLQ. And anything to do with a Q uh, always has an expression of U because the Q follows U. Now if it doesn't follow U, that means um, there was a miscommunication and one group is trying to destroy another group in order for truth to come out. They have no choice and they end up looking bad at the end when in all actuality they were good. And when did it become good? Years and years later when they were forgotten about, somebody else brought it into the element, whatever it may be, and they made good with this guy and nobody remembers because it was bad a long time ago, but the generations have passed and after 50 years, my friend, once you hear it at 25 and you're 75, you're really not paying attention to it anymore. So uh, things change, my friends. Thank you very much for the instance of this scenario. Um, there's so much. Oh, yes. You see, normally you go to a race. You finish, at, you finish at the red line, right? You see, this does not create pink. You see the pink bag? Okay. This, normally if you mix it, creates the pink. But because it's a square, right, and the square is the root of everything, each individual line can never turn pink. You see, when it's standing on the American flag, when they have the red and white lines, now you have the cancer because they're not squared. They're put together. It's sewn, the sewing is not together. You understand what I mean? When you see a square, it's a root of something. A man with a square hat, the graduate student, it's a complete, it's a circle, A, B, C, D. Okay, it's a reflection, A to C, B to D. Betty by and connection of the spirit of the free world. Okay, the square says there is no finish line. We come to be the Holy Ghost. We are pure. Ina. Regina. Regina. The ring. Angel. The kit. See where the line finishes here? It takes this K, which actually is a V. One V which means four and six, it's sideways because it was the kit, the I, which is the ninth letter, the T is the 20th letter, means the birth. And like I told you, just say J-I, which is J, which means me. Now they have it over here, the kit, 10. Chow mein, goodbye, chow mein, here's the 10 commandments, chow mein, chow is good, nutrition advanced. That's what it's all about, two pussy cats. One is you, and one is the one behind you is the angel inside you hoping you're going to make the right choices so 
everything you see, these ears, when you look at this ear, okay, you have one side of the ear, the other side of the ear, one side of the ear, the other side of the ear. If you would outline this and cut off the tips of this, because that's the problem, they create two U's, two V's, and 11, 11 on this. And the digital is right here between the cat's between the cat's hair because this is where his mind is that reset receives on both sides of his head his eyes are just inside his ears but if you notice the edge is right here the whiskers they twist and they whisker so kitten is 11 20 40 60 wow just in the first you get you get angel and man you get it all 65 79 789 right we didn't need the 8 no more once he ate him that was it all we had was the 7 and the 9 together. If the 7 eats the 9, the 9's inside the 7, right? So the 8's gone, the 9 is the birth, and it's inside the God. 9 inside 7's, we are in the heaven of our Lord. So you can listen to all the preachers you want out there, Gospels and whatever you want, but if you don't know what the word means when you go to sit down, because all words were given a meaning from the way man thought before he gave it the thought of the word he now put in front of an element of exposition, which they call a child in this instance they may call it a church a house of God or whatever for me they'll think they want to bring up and I'm not saying they're bad all I'm saying is we don't understand really what it means gospel we only see it their way gospel means to talk the gossip of all gospel leading the one and six spirit into the holy land of the ghost of the unknown gospel a spoken word a spoken word thought of heard before a story told from what is felt from within one's mind onto a book were these books multi-written or were they singular written the thought of one man in singularity bringing out the vision of love to others the way he sees the vision of love how do i see the vision of love well, when i'm so relaxed and my parents give me the opportunity that i can sit here today in front of all of you which actually there's none of you because i'm just making it now and to be able to do to express myself my biggest desire and love in life is just to express myself whether it's on paper whether it's driving a truck whether it's welding i always want to do it right perfectly but i also know at the same time i'm not going to battle my brain if it doesn't come out perfect i'll just know what did i do wrong and next time i'll try better or i'll try harder or maybe i didn't try hard enough this time so i thank my parents i thank my brother for screwing me on the left side but on the right side you know what, the right side is the most important and he's taking care of me. At least that's the way it seems. I don't know if it's going to last, but that's okay. For my sisters, well, they're sisters, they're mothers, so they're different for everybody. I can't see anything because they have a different view and we're always looking a different way. But that's okay because it's good to share in the hair, right? Which means the knowledge between one and the family, all in the family, all the men, all the women, we are they call us men. They call all machines she. It's a she. She didn't work today. The car didn't start today. She wasn't feeling too good, but that's okay. Um, the other thing is the wild, wild west, Danamore. There's just so much stuff out there. We should just continue to talk about this priest because Jesus tells a lot of stories. Somehow, Jesus, in his short time that he actually was preaching, he uh, really, really showed a lot onto these people to all want to come out and write a book of their great beliefs because there was a difference back then the element of spirit wasn't the same we had a higher up spirit okay back in the time but uh, as time goes on uh, the spirits have to be combinized and mixed I give you the one spirit with the two I give you the one with the three like combinations and that way he can help to uh, readjust and balance uh, your mind but it all takes uh, you and you and just about only you and there's no one else but you so unless you're ready to accept that the guy stopped too fast in front of you you're not going to stick your hand out the out the door and tell him he's a son of a bitch right you know what you tell him you tell him holy mac holy mac because you can't walk in, into mcdonald's on a sunday and talk about jesus at mcdonald's you got to go to church so if you talk about jesus everybody moves away from you looks at you as crazy or they're very interested so what you got to do is we just got to call him holy mac at the end of the conversation you say jesus christ holy mac jesus christ that was good 
So, you know, they won't know. Even though you want to pass on the word, um, when you're shunned down and pushed down to be silent, as long as you can get out the word with, with the who person you are with at the moment, you don't have to spread the word anywhere else if you're feeling that you're going to have to really be quiet. So you just call them the Holy Mac. And I chose that word because the Mac truck is all upside down and Chrysler and Christ, and they all go together, all upside down, but bringing the good word of equality pretty funny for a man like that, eh? Bringing the word of equality and all misunderstanding between everybody and they hung him because of the misunderstanding. Hang him up! Hang ten! Hang ten commandments!